The upper graph shows toner particles of various sizes and charges, moving between a developer roller and a photoconductor drum, in response to an AC bias of 800 volts and 2 kHz, and a DC bias of minus 400 volts, applied between the two rollers. Time, T, in milliseconds and its corresponding iteration index, K, are shown above the voltage difference between the two rollers. A 5-pixel wide line, depicted by a red bar, rotates from right to left. The lower graph shows how the photoconductor surface potential changes over time. When the AC bias switches its polarity, the photoconductor surface potential shifts up, or down. As the negatively charged toner particles gather around the latent image area, the surface potential becomes more negative. The surface potential gets closer to its original shape, indicated by the black dotted line, as the particles move away, from the image area. The toner particle size distribution, used in the simulation, is shown here. The toner charge density distribution is shown here. This graph shows the force of van der Waals adhesion as a function of particle radius and temperature. The total adhesion force as a function of toner charge, dielectric layer thickness, and temperature, is shown here.